tunnel that goes under the water. Here's the water flowing down the side. I don't. It, it doesn't. I've tried to stop it flowing down. I don't know if you can do it. It just. Yeah, I've tried. It, it flows even though it's not moving. And where are we? We're here on the other side of the dock. There's two piers. They're meant to be on the edge, but I extended it, so I need to move those. I'll show you that tower, first of all. Get a good look. We'll be able to walk all the way, we'll have to swim a little bit. This is just a big sand pit. Really? I thought it was a supermarket. I thought we'd have to swim further than that. Ooh. I get scared in the water. Ooh, no. Don't like deep water in games. Deep water in games are scarier to me than the nurses in Silent Hill. Because you can always hit them with a pipe. Well, you can hit water with a pipe, but it won't do nothing. And then here's a little garden. With no grass. Let's sort that out. That's wheat farm. Oh, 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 quick. Let's get up into the tower. The sun's going down. Quickly, quickly. We're going to miss it. So right now we've got a sunset and a moonrise. I won't go onto the top floor. I'll just go on to this one. You can see. Oh, look at that lovely sunset. That horizon is basically... No, not that horizon. That line there, that is as far as the game will render away from you. If I move, move that way, more stuff will appear. Uh, I hope Notch edits the game at some point to have it so you can see further if your hardware will allow it. Because my computer's a bit of a beast. And we got the, s the, the moon, rather. Luna. Look at that sand pit. See, there's the bridge going along into that mountain, which you can just about see. Right, since it's night time. Oh, yeah, let's check out the top floor. See, I need to make this safer. I want, I want it to be one more out. I've got no wood. One more block out, and then on that on that block, I'll have a fence so that you've got two blocks width to walk on. So if you have the fence there, you you can't move there. You're just restricted to one block walking out. So I want to sort that out. Would I make that jump into that water? Probably, but it. I don't want to risk it. I can jump into that one though. Let's do that now. Woo! Quick way of getting down. Right, since it's night time. Let's go inside. Not in there. Somewhere else. Right now, I need to get in here. But it's too high to jump while I'm in the water. So I'm just going to cheat. That keeps monsters out. I could do it more light in here. I have had monsters spawn here, despite the light they've already got. They probably spawn here, where it's darkest. Or there. So let's go down, down, down. Into the mine! We're going to go into... Ooh, see? We've got company. Ha. Now this... See, that's a monster spawner. This is a sun trap. See, the sun will shine through here and burn him. And I can just get free feathers. I did go right round here. I was going to have a little chest in there. 
But then I thought, you know what, sorry, I'll dig through. So I did. Dug through there, it's quicker. You still use stuff there, I suppose. I haven't gone down there. Well, I've gone down there, but there's not much there, but I will dig through there eventually. This is just protection in case anything spawns. There was another zombie spawner above here, which I destroyed. I was going to try and farm them, but I'm actually I'm under the water right now, so there's no chance of getting sunshine through there without a lot of hard work. So I just didn't bother. And we've got another sort of little station here. Coal. Ooh, that's done. So I disappeared and let that cook. Oh, smelt. We've got a door here going around to the other side of that. We can explore that way. See, there's that door. And um, we can jump down if you want, but instead we're gonna go down there through this staircase. So although we're underground, that little time device will let us know when the sun's come up. I can hear a skeleton. He's close. Very close. Where is he? Is he under there? <laughs> I don't like it. Obviously, I built this. I made this. Now, there is a place where monsters spawn close by, like above me somewhere. I know because I had the fright of me, like when I saw a spider right above me. Is it there? I think it's up there. Oh. There's also a bit where they spawn underneath. I can hear them now. Oh, iron up there. What I'm saying I can hear them now, I heard them half an hour ago when I got here. What's up there? They've got no arrows right now. Ooh, dark. Ooh, dark. something. In the words of Pete Postlethwaite from Alien 3, there's definitely something in here with us. Right, ah yeah, I'm filling that in. I want to fill that in right up to here so nothing can spawn. I don't need to use torches. I've got some iron. And I can reclaim those torches. So if I just reclaim the torches, it's going to be dark down there. And all monsters can spawn. And I don't like monsters. So I'll fill it up. Wait me way back. Just fill the whole thing up so nothing can spawn. And I can use those torches for something else. Same with here. I'll fill this up. Because there's nothing there. If I dug that way, I'll probably find something eventually. But there's loads of places I can dig. And there's no way anyone could dig everywhere. Well, I suppose you could, but it'd be boring. You want things to look somewhat interesting. Right, I can hear a zombie. Sword out. How do I get down there? That way. Let's go around. This way. How did I miss that? I've been down here loads of times. Imagine you're exploring and you just you're gonna miss things, aren't you? I suppose. Look more and loads of coal. Ooh, I think this. Yeah, this is as is this as far as I've explored. Yeah, it is. 
not much down.